Hey y'all and welcome to today's video. I have the new Glam Light Strawberry Shortcake Collection. I'm so excited to play with this. Oh, it's so, so cute. Look at it. Look at Strawberry Shortcake. I have the palette, the sponge, the lip products, the blush. We are going to swatch everything. We are going to test it out. I do want to apologize for my voice. It is not back 100%. I told y'all I had a busy weekend and my voice is just lagging a little bit. So I do apologize if it's super annoying. But if you're new here, I want to say hey. My name is Heather and makeup makes me happy here at my channel. We don't try to be perfect. We just want to have a good time with our makeup, whatever that means. I am uploading every single day right now. So I hope that you will subscribe before you leave but like I said I cannot wait to play with this collection so let's jump into it okay so we have the new glam light strawberry shortcake collection this is so adorable I love glam light they're one of my favorite favorite brands glam light did send this collection over to me and I do have an affiliate code with glam light if you're ever shopping the site you want you can use code Heather Austin to save I will put it in the description box but I let, let's just talk about this collection if glam light had not sent me this I would have bought it all believe because this is so adorable so we have like the thing that I would say I'm most excited about is the strawberry shortcake berry licious palette and strawberry shortcake like that just takes me back to my childhood look oh it's so so beautiful I'm 35 so this was right in my childhood strawberry shortcake and all her friends so I get all the nostalgia with this collection for sure like they definitely roped me in with that one but I love Glam Light. They make amazing, amazing products. So, I mean, I, I, I had to try this. I have to try this. I love that they didn't just go with like a monochromatic pink and red type of vibe. I love that we have all of these greens in here and I'm very excited. I think what we'll do today is we'll create two different eye looks. I would love to do more, but honestly, my voice is just not going to hold out for that long. I've got a drink here in front of me. I know like I, I don't have it in me to do a ton. So what we're going to do is do one look here and one look here. So we'll definitely play with these tones. It looks like we have some very intense sparkly shades in here, some really beautiful mattes. The thing that really caught my attention with this palette, and let me show you a close up in swatches as I'm talking, because I really like that this palette goes from light to dark. That Mm, I like that a lot. I, I cannot wait. We have beautiful strawberry shortcake here on the mirror. We do have a nice large mirror. So I can't can't wait to play with this. I also like this is a nice slim compact palette. I really like that. Okay, there was also a Berry Bounce Makeup Sponge in this set. I did not use the sponge getting ready today because actually it's a bit later in the day. I was getting ready to film something else. I had to take my son somewhere. And then when I came home, this was waiting on me. So I'm like, yes. I'm so glad I didn't do blush, lips, anything like that. So I didn't get to use the sponge. I will use it in the future though. It is very cute. It comes in this super duper cute packaging. And listen, I try a lot of makeup sponges and this may be the cutest one I've ever seen. Next up, we have the Berry Sweet Lip Kit. Let me show you a close up and swatches of this because this is adorable. So in this lip kit, we get a lipstick and a lip gloss. And I am wearing this right now. I was like, let me put this on, let me put this on because this smells like strawberries. The component here is really, really beautiful. If you run your finger right here, you can feel there's texture to strawberry shortcake. Like the, the lid is textured and I like that. It's not just like a flat print. And then you have this beautiful strawberry scented lipstick inside and then the gloss is really pretty too super duper cute we've got the strawberry seeds with the green top smells like strawberries love that 
love that for me. I love strawberries. And then we have strawberry shortcake blush. It's so adorable. Now the inside is going to be kind of hard to capture on camera, I know, but we do have strawberry shortcake. So beautiful embossed on the pan. And don't listen, don't be afraid. If you've never tried a blush shade like this, I'm telling you blush shades like this, I think look beautiful on every single skin tone. So pretty, so fresh. Definitely head to the Glamlight site if you want to see swatches on different skin tones, things like that, because Glamlight really does a great job at that. But we are definitely going to wear this blush today. I did not apply the blush yet. I want to do that with y'all. But now that you have seen everything, now that you've seen the swatches, you've seen up close, you've kind of heard my initial thoughts on things like just seeing them in person, how excited I am. I want to put these on the eyes, but I do have the lip kit on. So we're going to put on the blush together. I'm going to zoom y'all in a bit though. Okay, so we're going to apply the strawberry shortcake blush. I think this, this kind of blush really, like I said, it looks good on everyone, but I'm super excited because I do have this hot pink strawberry lip. I don't think I said, but the lip gloss is not too, too opaque. So I think it'll pair well with a lot of things. And the lipstick itself is a satin formula, which I really like. But I also just got these bling brushes in. These are so pretty. These are launching soon <laughs> soon I will put the details down below but I wanted to use these today I've never used blinged brushes so I thought this could be fun to try these together so I'm gonna pick up some of that blush oh that's a lot oh that's pretty yeah that's pretty so you can see why I say don't be intimidated by blush like this it's a very pretty, I feel like it's just very fun and it's almost like, I don't, I don't know, like I feel like I could be in the strawberry patch with this blush color. So I'm just going to put this on and then I'll let you see kind of side by side with the blush and without the blush. So here I have the blush here and we got no blush over here very very pretty very fresh looking that's the word I was trying to think of very fresh okay so I'm gonna kind of work on both eye looks at the same time so I get a look that's somewhat cohesive but what I'm gonna do is start first with very cute so for one eye I'm gonna go in with very cute and then for the next eye I'm gonna start with this shade right here sorry I just named it it's very cute is stamped on the pan but the next shade I'm going to go in with this green that has the strawberry stamped on the pan. Okay, so I'm just going to focus this matte shade in the front part of my crease. I'm going to take it all the way down here, but right into the socket. And I'm fine with it going like above the socket, below the socket. I usually don't go for like precision with my looks. So I'm just going to make sure I have that pigment there with this matte and that is really pretty. Very easy to work with. You can see I didn't have to try hard to get it to be this pink. Alright, this is another blinged brush and I'm going in with that matte green. You can see it's kind of the same level of depth as that matte pink really really pretty that's going on very easily so I'm just going to put it in the exact same placement and when I do two different eye looks that I'm going to be wearing for the rest of the day like I am today I just think it's easier to kind of go from eye to eye but of course you can just like if you got this collection or you're shopping your stash and you're wanting to follow along you definitely don't have to do both. <laughs> you could just do one at a time. Okay, now I'm going to go in with my Sigma brush. And I am going to play with this deep green shade. This also has very cute stamped in the pan. That's going to go here. And then over here for this eye, we're going to go into this dark shade right here up top. And I want to kind of like alternate these colors. So we're going to have the pink and green. We're going to have the green 
and kind of burgundy red. But what I'm gonna do first is just press this on. Just pressing it right there to this outer corner and I'll slowly, slowly blend it out. But I just wanna have that pigment like the deepest and darkest right in this outer corner and I'll just slowly work on blending it to match up with that pink that we went in with first and I'll blend more in just a second I just kind of want to show you the colors together so let me find another brush real quick okay then I'm taking that deep dark red shade right out here and it's going to go in the same placement now, if you want to do a monochromatic eye look where you just use, you know, all pinks on one eye, all greens on one eye, you can definitely do that. But I just really wanted to lean into the strawberry theme and do green, reds, and pinks on both eyes. Okay, I know this may be wacky to some of you to have like pink, green, green, red, but we're getting major Christmas vibes over here and I'm into it. Like I'm into this. I think this is fun. I'm not going to try to over blend here because I want it to be pink, green, you know, like I don't want it to be this blob. Now for the lid, we're going to go in with this shade right down here, this really mid-tone pink color we're gonna go on the lid here and then we're gonna take this green and go all over the lid here all right this is a refer what is this a zero two brush and I'm just going to put this beautiful sparkly pink metallic shade all over my lid but I'm not gonna take it all the way to the outer corner because I want to leave that with that green mat. I don't want that to be covered up too much. All right. Oh, green is my most favorite color. That is so pretty. Both of these shades on the lid are just so sparkly and wet looking. I'm so here for it. Okay, now I actually want to take this color right down here, and we're going to put that on the lower lash line of both, both eyes. I'm going to take this brush from the Bling Brushes set, and this has such a cute little strawberry embossed on the pan. I'm just going to use the palette mirror, actually. And I'm going to put that right there and blend it back and forth. Okay, now we're going to use the last two mattes in the palette. I'm going to use this one right here that was next to that deeper matte. This one looks a little more pinky purpley in tone. I'm going to put that to blend out this shade down here. And then this one that's a little more of kind of like an electric pink red, I'm going to blend out this over here. Okay, so I'm just going to blend right underneath. I really want to use as many shades as possible in this palette since I'm just able to kind of do these two looks today but I definitely want to create more looks with this palette like I said I just know like the limitations of my voice all right so that looks really pretty really blended out easily I'm not having to like really work with that at all like fight it or anything and then this kind of electric shade looks pretty too. So this is a Sigma brush and I'm just going to blend here. Okay, I've got a couple of Sigma pencil brushes here in front of me because I wanna add in some more of these shimmers. Like they're so beautiful. I wanna play with a few more. So what I think I'm gonna do, I've been kind of debating like which ones do I wanna grab. But I think over here for this green, we're going to do this one down here that looks to be almost like a, like a purpley, silver, pinky something. I want to add this in over here. And then over here for this in our corner, I want to go in with this really pretty, it looks like a duochrome, like a peach to purpley pink duochrome. Okay, so what I'm going to do here is take that shade and I kind of want to carve it right here into the front part of my crease. So just kind of feeling along the socket 
So it's just going to add a little something right in there, you know, between the matte green and the metallic that we have on the lid. And I chose a pencil brush because it's just going to let me kind of cut right in there really, really easily. And then I've got that other kind of duochrome shade right in here. It's just going to add a little something, something to the look, you know? Okay, I've been wanting to use this shade right here since I opened the palette because it looks so sparkly and beautiful. Oh, and it is, it is, it is. That is so beautiful. That's like a pinky, blue, purpley, something special type of shade right there for the inner corner. And then for this inner corner, I feel like we need to go in with this. This is another like special sparkly shade. It looks really, really beautiful. And this is just a Sigma Samantha Ravindol brush. And I'm going to put that right here. Well, I really like the textures and stuff they put in this palette. I'm going to finish up with some eyeliner. I'm going to use my Glamlight Scooby-Doo eyeliner because if you've been watching my videos lately, you know I'm loving that liner. I'm going to do mascara and I will come back. But these are the two eye looks. I'm feeling the strawberry vibes. Okay, y'all. <laughs> I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling this strawberry look. I did add on the Glam Light Scooby-Doo Lashes Liner and Highlight. I love this highlighter so, so much, but I just went in with the top shade. That's the highlight that I added. Okay, the palette. Let's kind of talk about the items in this collection. The sponge, of course, I can't talk about yet, but I will use it and I will let y'all know. Maybe I can do something fun on like TikTok or something with this collection. Of course, you don't have to follow me on TikTok and Instagram, but I do like to post extra content there. The palette, like that's the standout to me. I love eyeshadow palettes though. This is beautiful. We used 13 out of the 15 shades in this palette. The only shades I didn't get to try are these two right here, but I definitely will try them. If you have the Scooby-Doo palettes, the newest Michaela palette, this is amazing. Like the mattes blended like those mattes did. The shimmers are wet and gorgeous, but I actually think we really have some even like specialer shades <laughs> more special shades y'all know what i mean we have some beautiful duo chromes and things in here and if you liked the scooby-doo the new michaela i think you'll really really like this the mattes were very pigmented but easy to build easy to blend no issues the shimmers are very wet metallic very sparkly we do have some duo chromes we do have some extra 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 sparkly shades this is so cute i honestly like i'm gonna use this in the morning i'm gonna wake up in the morning and i'm gonna use this palette to get ready i also really like this blush this first of all the packaging is so cute and listen I am somebody like, I love cute packaging. I'm not gonna lie, when I'm using a product, of course the product inside has to be good for me to reach for it, of course it does. But if I'm looking in my makeup drawer, I'm like, what blush am I gonna use today? Packaging, like it's fun, it's a fun element, it's part of the experience, it's part of the fun to me of getting ready. So I'm definitely gonna be reaching for this blush. I love this shade, I think it's so fun and fresh and I'm here for it, it's so, so cute. And I really like this lip too. I really like the formula of this lipstick. This is, like I said, a satin liquid lipstick, not liquid lipstick, a satin bullet lipstick. And it just has a very faint strawberry smell. If you are like, ooh, I do not like the scent of strawberry, this doesn't linger. Like I can't still smell it, you know, after I'd put it on. But when I'm applying it, I love it. But again, I do love all things strawberry. Every year for my birthday, my mom makes, everybody in the family, my mom is like, I'm gonna make you your cake. What type of cake do you want? Every single year I want strawberry. It's my favorite. It's my favorite. So I love the strawberry scent. Again, I do apologize for my voice. I really like these two toned eye looks. 
I'm gonna be wearing these the rest of the day. I love the pink and green and green and red together. I hope you're having an awesome day. Let me know, did you pick up this collection? Are you shopping your stash? I would love to hear from y'all. Everything that I talked about today, I will link in the description box. So definitely check there if you have any questions, but I will see y'all tomorrow in another video. Bye. Thank you.